From the U.S. dollar's drop to China's faltering economy, these are the stories to watch in business and finance. The dollar is heading for its weakest monthly performance for a year. The prospect of a rapid flip to rate cuts by the Fed next year has driven investors into beaten down treasuries, pushing yields down and boosting stocks at the expense of the dollar. Seasonally, December is the worst month for the dollar, but it tends to recover in January. The Personal Consumption Expenditures Price Index due on Thursday is expected to show no change in October from the prior month, according to a Reuters poll. A Consumer Confidence Index report is due on Tuesday. The October reading showed a third straight monthly decline. COP28 gets underway in Dubai on Friday, with no consensus likely and pessimism around the key 1.5 degree warming target. The best that can be hoped for might be more money and focus from the big multilateral institutions like the World Bank, and deals on uncontroversial areas like tripling global renewable energy capacity. China's top economic advisor plans to recommend a 5% growth target for a second year, Reuters reported exclusively on November 22nd. They say more fiscal stimulus is needed to get there, but support measures have fallen short so far. China releases official manufacturing PMI data on Thursday, which last month showed an unexpected contraction, killing momentum for an economic recovery.